switch you to. You go on that side about the other people. Yeah, that would work too. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. After 16 years, the Comac Fire Department and the Comac Volunteer Ambulance Corps encourage everyone to remember and continue to pay tribute to the brave men <coughs> and women who lost their lives in the attacks on the World Trade Center, the Pentagon, and Flight 93 in Pennsylvania. At this time, we would uh, like to have a moment of silence to honor those who lost their lives. Thank you. Thank you, like the Ambulance, I would like to thank Chief Myers and the Comac Fire Department for inviting us here today. September 11th is a day that has impacted each and every one of us in some way. Most of us can remember with starting clarity where we were and what we were doing when we found out about the events that would forever change our world. Some of those who are present here today are too young to remember but still feel the effects of that day. Although the events of September 11th are a tragedy, our nation rose to unite and rebuild to new heights. Today we mourn the loss of innocent lives and acknowledge the brave men and women who made the ultimate sacrifice, including 412 emergency workers who perished while fulfilling their duties at the World Trade Center on September 11, 2001. We would like to recognize the bravery of the men and women who continue to struggle with 9-11 related health concerns. For some, the events of that day to continue to be a daily battle. Please remember to keep them in your prayers. 
It is an honor for the Comac Ambulance to stand beside the Comac Fire Department as we mourn the lives lost and commend the bravery of all emergency service present that fateful day. <coughs> as we return to our daily lives, let us remember that every day is an opportunity to us to, our, to use our actions to live up to the sacrifices of the heroes we lost that day. Lord, as we begin another year in the wake of the tragic events of 9-11, let us pray for those among us who continue to fight illnesses contracted on that day. Let us pray for the families of those who have gone to their eternal reward, that they may continue to live the fullest lives possible. We pray that they have found the peace and strength to endure while holding on to the cherished memory of those they have loved and lost. Heavenly Father, we, refer, we reaffirm our commitment to keep their memory alive in our hearts. We vow to continue our efforts to follow their example, to make those heroes proud of us. We will continue to carry their mission forward by protecting our community as they did, by doing our best to support and respect each other as those heroes of September 11th did. Lord, protect us in our fight. We beseech you, guard our families, guard, our, guard and guide us, bring us home safely, that you watch over them as we serve you in your will. Lord, we will continue to build the society that our heroes died to protect. We ask that when things seem darkest and our differences seem insurmountable, you remind us <coughs> what can be accomplished when our purpose is united. Let the shining example of our 9-11 heroes serve as our compass and our efforts to serve and defend each other. We place these intentions as well as those that we hold in our hearts in your hands, Lord. Amen. Cover. service for this evening. Please, uh, we have refreshments on uh, food on the side, please. Everybody's welcome to come.